Robin Windsor, a former professional on Strictly Come Dancing, has died age 44. He appeared on the BBC One show from 2010 until 2013, partnering with Patsy Kensett, Anita Dobson, Lisa Riley, and Deborah Mad. Strictly Come Dancing co-host Claudia Winkleman described the news of Windsor's death as heartbreaking. Presenter Tess Daly said it was such terribly sad news, adding Windsor was gone too young. Your infectious personality, energy, and talent will be deeply missed by all who knew you, Daly said. My heart goes out to your loved ones at this time. Good Morning Britain presenter Susanna Reid became emotional as she announced Windsor's death on Tuesday. He was a remarkable dancer, incredibly strong, so creative. He was just so enthusiastic about dancing, she said. I just adored him. He was the most incredible personality. There was something very special about him. Windsor danced with Reid on a Children in Need Special of Strictly. He was also paired with Great British Bake Off host Alison Hammond in the 2015 Christmas special. Strictly's longest standing judge Craig Revel Horwood described Windsor as one of the kindest, gentle, honest, funny, and caring people I've had the pleasure of knowing and working with. He will be forever missed. My heart goes out to all his family and friends. Strictly's head judge Shirley Ballas added, I'm very saddened to hear the devastating news about this beautiful human being this morning. Robin Windsor, kind, gracious, gentle, and extremely hardworking. A wonderful dancer, true gentleman, good soul, and so very young. Uh, former judge Bruno Toniel added, Incredibly sad, shocking news. It was a pleasure working with Robin for many years at Strictly, so professional, easy, going a really good person. Actress Lisa Riley, who was paired with Windsor in 2012, posted, My bestie, my Robin, my angel, now our forever angel, who is loved, will always be loved forever in my heart. I love you. Shine your, your beautiful electric energy from heaven. In a statement, read out on this morning, Hammond said, I'm completely heartbroken. He was one of the nicest people to work with and so much fun to be around. I had the pleasure of dancing with him for the Strictly Christmas special, and they were such special times. My thoughts are with his family and friends. Announcing Windsor's death, Disco Entertainment told BBC News, His extraordinary ability to express emotion through movement captivated audiences, leaving them spellbound with every step. Beyond his impeccable dancing, Robin's vibrant spirit lit up the room, infusing rehearsals and performances with infectious energy and warmth. His laughter was contagious, his kindness boundless. His friendship was a gift cherished by all who had the privilege of knowing him. Robin, you will be deeply missed. Former Strictly Pro James Jordan said, I had the pleasure of working with this man for many years on Strictly. I have such fond memories of him. He was always very caring and fun to be around. Everyone who came in contact with him adored him, from his celebrity partners to his working colleagues. You will be missed old friend. Ballroom dance company Burn the Floor said it had lost one of its founding members. He danced with us for 20 years, including Broadway, the West End, and all our crazy adventures around the world. They said in a statement on social media, he leaves a void in our hearts. Windsor was born in Suffolk and first began dancing at the age of three when his parents enrolled him in classes in Ipswich, according to his website. He moved to London age 15 to pursue a dancing career and went on to represent England in numerous championships both on the domestic and international levels. In addition to Strictly, Windsor appeared on Dancing with the Stars Australia, and so you think you can dance in Holland. Windsor had most recently been starring in Come What May, a Moulin Rouge tribute show. He was forced to pull out of Strictly Come Dancing in 2014 after suffering ongoing back problems caused by a slip disc. Windsor was an advocate for mental health and worked closely with the SANE charity. Strictly professional Karen Hauer said she was heartbroken, describing Robin as a beautiful human being. Her co-star Graziano Di Prima said he still can't believe it. While Neil Jones posted, Every moment I spent with Robin, he was always a joy to be around with the biggest heart. Posting on Instagram stories, Diane Biswell said it was a pleasure to share the stage with Windsor, while Amy Dowden described him as a kind, talented soul. In an Instagram comment, Strictly co-host Claudia Winkleman said it was heartbreaking, while former pro dancer O.T. Mabuse said, Robin was one of the kindest, loving, professional, creative, and beautiful humans. 
Pro dancer turned judge Anton Dubik said he was absolutely devastated to hear the sad news about Robin, a person I've known for the best part of 25 years, from a young competitor to a star of Strictly Come Dancing. In my eyes, he was always a star. We're going to miss you, Robin. Former judge Arlene Phillips told BBC Morning Live, Robin was the most powerful Latin dancer you could wish for. Every step, every move was imbued with the drama of Latin. I'm often doing or staging charity events, and I could always call him and say, I need a dancer, and Robin would be there. He was sweet and kind, and there was something so lovely about him, a passionate driven, and I am devastated he's so young. He's just a baby, uh, as far as I'm concerned. He'll be very, 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 very much missed.